Hey, how y'all doing today? Uh, Bill here. Uh, as you can see, I've got a Telecaster here. This is an Austin Telecaster. As you can see, it's pretty conventional. Looks like any Squire, Fender, uh, Telecaster you might see. It's got uh, just general two tuners on it. Um, I think it's made in Indonesia uh, or China, I'm not sure which. But uh, just wanted to share with you um, that it's, uh, it's got a nice maple neck. It has a maple fretboard on top of that. And it's other than that, I can keep bumping into the wall there. Other than that, it has your your uh, bridge pickup, and it's a pretty good one. It sounds really good. I mean, it doesn't sound like a cheap guitar pickup. It sounds like maybe uh, you know, like an American or Mexican Fender. So anyway, something like that. But it's got your your regular uh, 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 lipstick style pickup in the in the front there. So you have a standard three position switch. See that front, middle, back. So that's your bridge pickup. That's both of them, and that's the front. Doesn't get any simpler than that, folks. You have a tone knob or volume knob, volume knob right here, tone knob back here on the on the back. Standard Tele stuff. The uh, the main difference you'll notice probably is the fact there's those holes in the back, which means you it doesn't thread through the back. It does have a nice neck plate, says Austin on it right there. Uh, but uh, in any case, uh, your strings feed right through the back here. So they don't go through the body. Uh, kind of like a, uh, you know, uh, like an Ovation acoustic guitar. They, they load really easy that way. I, I do like that. And honestly, I've not found any difference in sustain or any of that other stuff that people talk about. I mean, it could be, but I'd be willing to bet that on a video, you'd never hear the difference. And, um, you know, if you need more sustain than what it has, um, then maybe you need to add a compression pedal or a sustain pedal or something, you know, uh, or, or something to it to, to, to get what you want. And there's ways to do that. So, you know, these days, it's not like an old acoustic guitar where, you know, everything, you know, and uh, just like the, the whole wood business, you know, uh, and that argument goes on for days and years, no doubt. You know, a maple versus, a, uh, you know, a rosewood or an ebony fretboard or whatever it might be today. They've got these other synthetic materials now. What with rosewood being endangered, I guess, or something like that. So, you know, there's going to be other materials come out and uh, it already has been, really. I mean, but in any case, um, but just want to give you a few sounds off of this. Um, I, I would highly, uh, you know, recommend it. I really thought, uh, you know, um, I mean, I'm straight up and honest with you guys. You know, obviously, I'm just a little guy. I don't get anything from this uh, other than sharing it with you. Uh, when I run across something good, I want to share it with you. And so, uh, you know, these things can be bought for a song, especially used on either uh, eBay, Craigslist, or OfferUp, or wherever you're looking for, you know, your used gear at. Uh, I see them cheap, you know. I've seen the Strats for like 60 bucks, 50 bucks, whatever. Uh, I haven't seen another Tele like this. If I did, I'd probably buy it because I've just been so impressed with this one. Uh, the neck, the fit, finish, everything. The tuners are really good on it. So, uh, you know, uh, it's like when you buy it, uh, it's going to work. You know, the potentiometers work. You know, you don't... You don't turn it and all of a sudden it changes at the very end or something. It, it actually, you know, gradually goes up or down with the tone being, you know, darker or lighter or, or you know, when it's wide open. Uh, the uh, control knobs, and they feel good. They feel, I mean, they feel really like an American telly or strap. They feel that good and that smooth. Uh, I did open the plate up and they're not, you know, they're the smaller pots, but uh, there must be good quality small pots because I mean they're very smooth, very nice. Uh, so anyway, I really you know can't say enough about. It. I'm just I'm so impressed. Uh, but anyways, uh, for what I do, it works great. Let me just say it like that. So anyways, I'll give you a few sounds. Uh, as you can see, I'm on the front pickup right now. Middle pickup. 
brightens up a little bit and on the course on the bridge. Stones, right? I was born in a cross by a hurricane. I yelled at my poor brother in the rain. It's all right. Never think it's a good So you can play, you need know, to play old rock and roll. You can play, you can play anything on the telly. I mean, Billy Gibbons said it. If you can't play it on the telly, it can't be played. So, I mean, you know, what do you got to do? You just need to you need to add the right distortion pedal if you want distortion. Uh, there's people, I mean, John 5 plays metal on them. You know what I'm saying? So uh, you can do whatever you want to do with them. You can play country, uh, blues. You can play anything on them. They, they've been used for everything over the years. So in any case, um, but uh, let me give you just a few sounds. Uh, we're already on the bridge. I'll just leave it there for now. Okay, now we're going to go to the middle position. Really nice and smooth and creamy. Now we're on the neck position, all the way on the front. Okay, so that was uh, going through a few things like that. How about if you want to play, a, maybe you want to play just a little rhythm. Uh, that's, uh, that's mostly what I do anyways, but uh, let's try. Um right there and I've, I'm not adding anything to it really. Let's go to the middle position. That was the bridge and now we're in the middle position. That's both pickups, don't forget, for those of you that, that don't know that. Just a little bit warmer. Okay, now we're going to the front pickup. Okay. One more yet. now. Just a little creamier, still got some bite to it though. Okay, now we're going to the front position, all the way on the front pickup. Here we go. So.
front pickup. Still the front. Let's go to the middle position, both pickups. Here we go. Okay, now we're going to the back pickup, the bridge pickup. <laughs> Just trying to give you a bunch of different sounds, that's all. Run through the party in the county jail. Bring them there was there, they began to wail. Let's say, don't you be no square. If you can't find a body, you can go to the chair that's wrong. Find a death wrong. Everybody in the whole cell block. Everybody in the hole, everybody in the Let's see, everybody in the hole cell block. Dance to the tail ass up. Hope you had a little fun with that at the end. I know I kind of goof up a little bit, but hey, it's a good time. And the main thing is to really demonstrate, uh, you know, that this is a good solid guitar. If you run across one, I, hey, I'd give it a try. Uh, probably not going to cost you much to give it a try. And you might just be like me. I'm, I'm very impressed. So in any case, <clears throat> um, hope you have a great day and we'll see you next time.